Welcome to our TNA5 Time and Attendance Package demonstration. We have made our TNA5 Time and Attendance Package easy for you. Select your hardware and once you have done this we can then ship your package out to you ready to go. If you have any questions please contact us. This time in attendance demonstration will walk you through adding your employees, collecting your clockings, calculating the daily and weekly hours, checking sick and annual leave, and preparing your file for payroll, eliminating much of the manual processing that you currently do. We can add employees via a spreadsheet in bulk format, or we can add employees one at a time. To add an employee, we select the employee icon, and we select the add so add the employee and we put in the details for the employee the details go in and we can select what rules are associated with this person we'll put them on casual shift and then we can select their classifications which company do they belong to agency staff and which department, we'll put them in casual. If you're using cost centers, you can apply them to cost centers. And we'll make them non-salary. All these classifications can be set uh, based on your requirements. And we'll go OK. And the employee has been added. Collecting the employee clockings can come from any number of types of hardware and or software, spreadsheets, and using the web interface, logging in through the internet to bring clockings into the system. We'll just have a look at the clockings. We select the clocking icon, and here we can see all the clockings for all the employees for one particular day. And if we wanted to see the clockings for one individual employee, we'd come in and select one employee, and select clockings over here, and then we can see all the clockings for that particular employee. With the clockings in the system, TNA5 can then calculate the daily hours. There's nothing here to do by the user, it all happens in the background. Let's just take a look at some daily hours. Select the daily hours icon and we'll come down here and we can see a number of daily hours for these employees for this particular day. Here's one here with one hour and 45 in overtime one. Close that. We can look at an individual employee and the individual employee daily hours by selecting the individual employee and selecting the daily hours. Here we can look at the daily hours for this employee. And on this particular day that we choose, we can actually go back and see the clockings relating to that particular day. Once TNA5 has calculated all the daily hours, at the end of each week in the background again without user intervention, the system will calculate all the weekly hours ready for payroll or payroll hours. Let's have a look at some payroll hours. Click on the payroll icon and we can come down here and see as an example Cindy with 56 hours in total, 40 hours at normal time and some allowance here for a night shift. Each individual system is configured to match your requirements. In this example it's overtime 1 and overtime 2. Your requirements may be different and these will be configured to suit your requirements. Let's look at one individual employee and we'll look at Cindy again and let's just look at her payroll hours and here we can see Cindy's payroll hours for the week. These are typically the hours that will go through the payroll to see that Cindy is paid correctly. The next step with TNA5, after we've collected all our clockings and all the calculations have been done for us and we've had a look at our leave, is we need to prepare our file for payroll. To prepare our file for payroll, we select the payroll icon, we select our payroll that we're going to use. There are many payrolls in the market today and we can import our data into every payroll product that has the ability to import data. If you are not sure about your payroll, please contact us. Select the print button 
and we'll give the file a name it's ready to be imported into our payroll we'll select start and this will save the file to our PC and then we can import this file in around 60 seconds or less into payroll eliminating all the manual data entry that you would do on a weekly or fortnightly or monthly basis from your timesheets or bundy cards now for any further questions on the payroll please contact us I'm sure you can see how TNA5 will save you a lot of time and to make TNA5 easy to use we've created wizards the wizards as an example with classifications will allow you to easily come back and do jobs that you may have forgotten how to do because you may not have done them for some time let's set up a new classification we'll select the classifications to use we'll use branch we'll enter some classifications you can see here we've already added Sydney and Melbourne just add another one we'll go OK and now we'll classify the employees and we'll go and put the employees into the correct branch so now that we can do all our reporting on the right people in the right branches the wizards make everything very easy to, to, to do and you can always come back and revisit the wizards at any time by selecting our green arrow important part of excellent time and attendance systems is the ability to track and monitor leave and report and show leave in an easy to read format. In TNA5 we have a little leave calendar that allows us to see the leave for all the employees. It's color coded to make it easy to read as you get familiar with the colors and you can set the colors to your own choices. You can forecast into the future and look at December in this instance and see who is on holidays in December to plan around that. We can look at one individual employee and we'll select one employee and look at their leave and when we look at their leave we can see it in a spreadsheet format or we can go to the leave calendar which shows all the leave for that one individual and as the data builds up over time we have history of each employee and their leave. There are many features within TNA5 that allow us to manage the employees. An example of those features is the warnings. The warnings will, allow, will alert us to people who have left early, arrived late, absent for example. Let's take a closer look at the analysis of this. We'll select left early, arrived late and absent. Search by company and we'll calculate. And we can see here the difference between agency staff for example and payroll employees left early. We'll go down and select department to give us a closer look at what's happening and here we can see uh, the departments broken down and the left early and arrived late and absent warnings.